is going on guys? I am back. Uh, uh, I should say my name. I'm the fourth gen gamer. I'm Josh. You know, I'm chilling here. We're doing some more Alpha Sapphire playthrough and I did the first grunt battle on the second floor of the Weather Institute. That's where we're at if you are new by the way. And I was like, you know what? Swampert? We're, we're about to get the Swampert. Our Mars time's going to evolve. And I didn't really want to do that. Uh, I didn't want to do that off screen. I, I wanted to just do a simple grunt battle. It's like, yeah, you know what? We're going to grow a level. You know, it, it didn't exactly cross my mind until the middle of the battle. So we're going to get this nice Swampert evolution at the very beginning of the episode, which is uh, amazing. Because Swampert, uh, I fucking love Swampert. Uh, you know, I just figured I'd whisper that into the microphone instead of screaming it out loud so my parents don't duck in and, like, look at me like I have 5,000 eyes. But holy shit, Swampert, Swampert. Swampert is the fucking shit. I love Swampert. So that was just the first battle, but oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Swampert's cool. That's the bottom line here. Anyway, we're gonna finish up this nice weather institute today. We did the first floor last episode, and I just did that uh, first battle right there off screen because uh, I figured out oh, let's not waste too much time. It's just a crump battle. There's no specific uh, crazy dialogue or anything that we're missing, so uh, you know why? Why waste the time? Anyway, we're here. We have a Mega Manic trick. We're about to be Mega Manic Trick once we just click that little wonderful button there. And uh, if you guys missed the end of last episode, we did get rid of the Spark and we got rid of Hell and we replaced it with Overheat and uh, Volt Switch because those are special attacking moves. And we want to base this Me uh, Mega Manic Trick Mega Manic Trick specifically around special attacking moves because I now realize how shit compared to each other's stats. Its physical attack was compared to its special attack. So now, now we have a wonderful, uh, more special attacking Mega Trick than we did before, which is. Definitely a big improvement for us, so I, I will say I'm a little bit surprised that we're, we are a l just underperforming a little bit like Volt we'll Switch I would expect to do a little bit more because of Stab and especially you have the super effectiveness on the Gold Bat, Mega Evolution, all those different factors, but I guess still it ain't good enough for the game. It ain't good enough for the game uh, to kill it, I guess, in one shot, but I'm not too worried. A nice Zen Headbutt from Matang, a uh, nice shiny Matang, and that should be enough to take out the Gold Bat. Anyway, that is, uh, that, did we take it out? Is that, uh, the end of the trainer? room? Electric picks up a level, that's pretty chill. But is that the end? Yes, that, uh, that's the end of this Team Rocket Grunt. Or, Rocket. <laughs> nice! Rocket Grunt, exactly. We're definitely facing Team Rocket right now. I just realized that this is a Psychic Dragon-type, isn't it? And we are going to have a Dragon-type there, and a Psychic-type there. Uh, that'll be Dragon eventually. So, that kind of sucks. We're going to be doubling up on two types, Psychic and Dragon, but, you know, of all the types, Psychic and Dragon are actually not terrible to double up on, but it's not like it's a Nuzlocke or anything. It's not terrible for doubling up on types, and, you know, we're not doubling up on a lot. It's only two, and, uh, for that matter, all my Pokemon will have at least two types. No, Manectric won't, but all my other Pokemon are going to have two types, and that's, uh, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Anyway, oh my, I even run into you when I'm not on the clock. I wonder why that is. Maybe we're destined to be together. <laughs> Want to know something? I'm feeling so empty and downhearted right now. I can't get my head straight. I think this is the time where we just fuck around the pussy. Nah, maybe. Uh, maybe, maybe. I don't know if I'm into her. She's, uh, she looks a little weird. Anyway, uh, um, help me take my mind off of it. The way you and your Pokemon battle so straightforwardly and sincere, uh, sincerely with such hope, it makes me so mad. It makes me mad. Yeah, I'm sorry. You're just a depressing, you know, 25-year-old that's kind of addicted to crack. And uh, you, sh I'm, I feel bad. You have your parents are divorced. You are a crack baby, and you have drinking problems. And I, I just feel bad for you. Uh, <laughs> that probably went a little too far compared to what it should have been. But oh well, oh well, oh well. If you're angry at me, then uh, sucks to suck. All right, we're gonna use our nice Volt Switch Mega Evolution Mag Trick. And uh, if this doesn't one hit it, I don't know, man. Uh, have a little higher expectations, not gonna lie. The Intimidate's pretty nice, though. I, I, I do really like Intimidate with Manectric, because especially you're facing a lot of physical attacking Pokemon, like a Sharpedo, you know. And was that the voice crack? Yeah, I just got a voice crack. Oh, well. Oh, well. So, that's, uh, that was really easy. We actually won't hit a Pokemon. Bravo! Although, <laughs> Sharpedo's not very defensive by any means. Speechless. Hmm. <laughs> I, feel, I feel a bit more relaxed. Thanks. As a token of my gratitude, I'll tell you one thing. When Team Aquas, no, when the Illustrious Illustrious, okay. Archie's ambitions have and realized the world will truly return to its beginnings to before the birth of anything at all. Think for yourself about what to do when you're up against the rea uh, that reality. I still haven't figured out for myself what's wrong and what's right. See ya! I'm sure I'll run into you again though. 
Yeah, I'm sure I'll run into you, you crackhead. Uh, Archie is probably on the way to Mount Pyre, so I... You better go with him to Mount Pyre. Thanks. Bye. See you later. The evil teams have just such a... They just they all have one commonality. They all like to just talk to themselves super duper loud so we can hear them and all their projects and what they're planning on doing. They have that Team Galactic, Team Rocket. I think like every team at one point, at least one person does that. They're talking so loud to themselves. It's like, oh, I didn't mean to say it that loud. Oh no. Uh, thank you, young one. You helped save us from quite a pinch. Uh, you okay there, mate? Ha, <laughs> That truly was a slap in the face. Uh, was he like crying or what? It sounded like he was laughing. Those thieves, what could they hope to gain by investigating the extreme weather patterns of thousands of years ago? Well, shit, mega evolution, primal reversion, all that cool stuff. Oh, but I'm forgetting myself. First, I must thank you properly for your help. It must seem, uh, I might seem odd, an odd way of rewarding you, but please take this Pokemon as my thanks. And, uh, yeah, we can't carry any more Pokemon. Why don't you come to call again after you've made space on your team? You know what? Um, that's actually pretty useful. Uh, I should, probably should be reading all this. Uh, oh, well, I skipped a few lines. Sucks to suck. By absorbing the energy that abounds in the natural world, Kyogre transformed itself. Or it's so it said... Uh, the transformed Kyogre caused so much disturbance to the weather patterns that the world was assaulted by torrential rains and the seas rose around the planets. We refer to this transformation as primal reversion. It's the result, uh, its result is what the terror we call primal Kyogre. Primal reversion is a possible form of evolution, like and yet not like Mega Evolution, or so it has been theorized, but has never been achieved by any other Pokemon. Uh, than the super ancient legendary Pokemon, and so that has so it has been largely forgotten as a method of evolution. If you'll excuse us, then uh, I probably yeah I skipped some dialogue that I probably shouldn't have. Oh well, sucks. Too suck as I said, and uh, yeah, ouch. Oh well, uh, we'll be heading downstairs now. But talk to us when you have a moment. We want to thank you as well. All right, so I guess do we? Uh, you know, I'm not gonna go to. I know there's a PC downstairs, so we can free up a slot. If you guys do want the cast form and you want a nice easy way of freeing up some room, there is a PC right there, but at the same time, like, eh. Eh, I don't really care. I don't really want a cast form, and if I do, then I'll just go back here. Or just get it from X and Y, or Pokebank, etc. So, what do we have down here? Is this anything cool? Any items or anything? Uh, I could use Surf and Explore, but I guess that's for another time. We're about to head into Fortree after we battle May, of course, yes. Uh, anyway. Josh, gosh, where have you been hiding? I've been looking all over for you. Cool question mark. Oh, I said that out loud. What a derp I am. Oh, well, where do you get that thing on your wrist? That's a pretty fancy looking bracelet. You wanna see it in battle? You wanna see it? You wanna see it? Ah, you wanna see how big it is? Wanna see how big my dick- uh, 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 I mean Venusaur? Okay, let's battle May. Let's battle our nice rival here. Uh, alright, cool. This is, uh, we only battled her like two other times, I feel like. We've seen her a few other times. Uh, we battled with her once. We've seen her a decent amount of time. She's always kind of catching up with us and stuff. And maybe I will change it up a little bit. Maybe we'll go for an evolution, mega evolution with our Latias. Just because, you know, I'm not even going to do like that type of switch. I'm just going to use Volt Switch because I can. I'm going to mega evolve into our Latias. Because we've only mega evolved into Latias once. And uh, <laughs> every other mega evolution, uh, you know, obviously it's been Mana Trick. And we've been doing a lot of battling with Mega Mana Trick. So let's shake it up a little bit, you know. When stuff starts to get boring, shake it up, you know? Alright. There we go, Rock Slide. We can take it. We can take it. I know I'm kind of cheap for using a lot of I feel like when I'm watching a few Let's Plays here and there, I've been seeing definitely, uh, I've been seeing a lot of people using Latias and Latios a lot more than I thought, because a lot of people usually pass up on the Legends. I'm just kind of doing it for fun, because you can catch it this early in the game, or not even catch it. They just give it to you. But I think that's pretty cool. Anyway, Dragon Breath, not too concerned. Uh, that should be nice and easy. And I think I have to go through the moves and see if Latias can learn anything else. But, uh, you know, I kind of wonder. You guys can let me know, but is there any difference between Latias uh, and Latios when it comes to their Mega Evolutions? They do look really similar. Not statistically, but just in their design, because they really look similar. I think Mega Evolution kind of, like, connects them to be nearly identical. But do any of these moves do damage? That doesn't do any damage. That does 70. Oh, okay. I know that did damage. You wouldn't think that it would. It's like Mist Ball. It just doesn't... It sounds like, uh... Oh, it's like an Ice-type move, Mist. I think that our Swabble even knows it. But, I mean... There's probably more added effects I shouldn't read. But, it's only 70 damage. But, you know, oh well. Oh well, that, uh... Oh, I think it always lowers... That may always lower their special attack. Because I remember it said something about lowering special attack. Uh, special -ing. 
uh, lowering special attack, but I didn't think it would be every time. Maybe it is. It could be. Definitely could be. I think I want to battle with our Swampert here, because <laughs> I haven't battled with Swampert yet. I've been so consumed with all the Mega Evolutions. And Refresh? Ah, nah. Nah, Refresh is pretty chill, but not feeling it. Uh, Whalmer? Ah, you know what? You know what? This is a perfect opportunity for us to use our Manectric. Not Mega Evolution. I think it's going to be our first battle that we're using Manectric, but not Mega. <laughs> I swear, if they didn't have the mechanic in the game that you can only have one Mega Evolution, my team would be coded, coded with these Megas. <laughs> Alright, so Volt Switch, maybe one hit. I don't know. Uh, wow, one hits, even without the Mega. So Mega Evolution would have absolutely demolished that Whelmer. <laughs> Alright, so, oh, so close to that uh, level up, but oh well. I think that I might have to switch into our Swabble, so Swabble can uh, maybe get some extra XP. I know that we have the XP share, but uh, Switch Painting will make that even faster. Uh, hmm, well... You did battle me, I, like I asked, so I'll give you a reward. And we get Fly, that's pretty chill. That is pretty chill, not gonna lie. If you use Fly, your Pokemon will carry you back to anywhere you've seen before, but you must have the gym edge from Fortree City to use Fly out of battle. And the, the most important bit, so don't forget, maybe you should fly home and visit Little Hurt sometime. I think that the game's trying to send me a message. I gotta go home and say hi to my mom, because Norman said it, our dad, and uh, May said it. I feel like I've heard it a few other times. But anyways, anyways, we have a rare candy? What the fuck? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. <laughs> Alright. I didn't even know that we have one of those. And I think I'm using it on there. Nice Swablu, because Swablu needs the uh, Swablu needs them levels. And you know with that rare candy, I think I'm not even gonna do the switch level, because I didn't realize it's level 26. That's pretty okay. Well, okay, nice rare candy. I didn't even know that they existed. I'm not gonna complain. And what are we doing? What are we doing? We're teaching fly. That's what we're doing. Blah, blah, blah. Cool deal. Cool deal. Cool deal. -io. I think I'm gonna do the four tree gym. I would love to do that. And oh shit, we're going to get our mega stone for Swampert as well. Oh shit, yo. That makes me happy. Uh, wow, I'm in a good mood now. Uh, gonna get that nice mega Swampert. Ooh. I gotta say, uh, what the, when I first mega evolved. Swampert in the demo, I like shit a brick. I literally like it, my chair had a brick on it. I shit a brick, man. Uh, <laughs> it was so much fun seeing that thing mega evolve, and I'm excited to have it consistently mega evolving in this playthrough because it's a uh, mega Swampert. All right, anyway. Wow, these past few episodes we have been just just steaming, steamrolling through this game, as I would say. Cause I don't know, I'm just stupid. We're going to go do this uh, Steven events. And we are going to get our Mega Stone. I believe, I believe that this is, I believe that this is where you get your Mega Stone at least. All right, so we're gonna climb up this nice ladder. This is pretty nice. This is really nice. I remember. Oh, look at this. I like that the bridge is all like it's shaking and stuff. Really, uh, much more realistic than your traditional, uh, you know, Fortree City setup. I remember that you couldn't run on those there though. Uh, oh, I was gonna go get that TM, but I can't. I forgot. I need to do the Steven thing. All right. But yeah, you couldn't run on these, which was kind of annoying, uh, I think. Could you not run? Uh, I forget. Oh, well. I think they couldn't. Anyway, oh, Steven's there. I thought he was, like, farther in. I guess that was in the originals. Hmm, it looks as though the Pokemon can be found up on Route 120. Oh, is he investigating that, uh, Kecleon thing or whatever? I guess he's just, I don't know, he's doing whatever. He's doing whatever. He's just Steven. He's doing whatever. Uh, all right, let's go on our bike. Let's speed things up a little bit. I kind of wish I didn't play this game always at night. I should just like change my clock because I'm always playing this at night and I kind of want to see Hoenn with RS a little more during the day and at sunset and stuff. And in the morning, you know? Because uh, the game does look excellent during the daytime, but I mean, if you only record it at night, then well, you're just out of luck. Unless you want to change your clock, which like I said, I might just do just for the shits and giggles. All right, uh, let's go over here. Get yeah, for a bike. Even though I like just got on, I want to like be careful I want to avoid some trainers and whatnot because we're still looking excellent with the levels. So uh, I don't want to be too OP. I want to keep the XP share on, but you know, not battle as many trainers. That's the lazy way of doing it. <laughs> keep the XP share on and just battle the least amount of trainers that you can because you're still kind of OP. So you know, I'm a cheap motherfucker. All right, we got away from the gloom. That's nice. I'm happy about that. And I don't know if we'll have time for the gym. Ah, uh, it's gonna be close. All right, uh, are we gonna make it down without any trainers? Yeah, I think we will. I don't need trainers. I don't need trainer battles. That's pretty cool. Hmm? 
Yes, well, what's up, man? Please give me my swamp today. Just give it, just give it. Just so we meet again has been, uh, yeah, Mega Bracelet has been awesome. I suppose, uh, yeah, yeah, cool, cool, blah, 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 blah. You notice there's something in the way that we can't see. Yep, 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 I don't care. Give me the Devon scope. We'll just battle the kick lane real quick. And then, uh, yeah, can we just, can we just, can we just get that, uh, yeah, we're ready for battle. Can we just get that, uh, yes, yes, please, 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 please. <sighs> that's not the swamp date. Alright, that's the Devon scope. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Cool, we got the Devon scope. Yeah, and there's a Kecleon. Would you look at that? That is just insane. Mind blowing. I am just so excited to battle this Kecleon. I have just been waiting ages to see this thing, this event with the Devon scope on the 3DS since I was like negative five years old. Uh, can we just run? I would love this. There we go. Let's run. Okay, just give me the just, 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 just Give it to me. Just give it. Just give it. Give it to me. Give it to me. Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, just as you expected. That's Devon Scope. Fantastic piece of technology. You get to see Pokemon that are hiding. And yes, please, please. <sighs> yeah, thank you for the Devon Scope. Oh, I love you, Steven. Just give it to me. Yes! I love you. I love you. <laughs> Steven. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Yes, I know it's your favorite stone. You're the best. You're the bomb. You're amazing. Whatever. Blah blah blah. You're freaking awesome. All right. Yeah. You're just talking about the meteor. I don't give a fuck anymore. We got a mega swamp. We got mega swamp. Well, you know the equivalent of that, I guess. All right. Woohoo! All right. So now, yeah, we're gonna take away the quick claw. Oh well, sucks to suck. Uh, we got a mega swamp. Oh yes. Yes. Oh, I'm a happy person now. <laughs> uh, I love Mega Swampert, in case you did not know. Uh, I freaking love it. I uh, just think it's amazing. And if I could use one all day, I probably would. Alright, uh, we avoided that trainer very nice. And whoop de fucking do. Can we get away with no trainers at all? Yeah, there, there we go. Oh, yes, look at that skill. That skill, though. That skill, though. Alright, so, uh, sadly we can't climb ladders with bikes, which doesn't work that way. Sorry! And that's using this as a walkthrough, you cannot use bikes on the ladder. <laughs> Although, Lloyd, would you look at that? No, we, we can we can ride up here, though. That ain't bad. <laughs> Alright, so now we can get down here and shit. Alright, can we use Mega Swamp? I, I would just love to. Yes, Devon Scope, whoop de doo fucking amazing, just hardcore, new, awesome technology. Alright, groundbreaking technology, and oh, that's very nice, that is a great design for a gym, I love it. And this will be Team 86 Grass Nut, a cool move, probably not the best for this gym, but hey, it's a move, it's awesome, and uh, I don't give a fuck, I just want to fly. I just want to use fly, I want to be able to fly on laddie ass, and I'll be a happy person. And this is a different gym design, alright, well, eh, not totally different, but it's uh, almost... Uh, it's it's like it's the same idea but just really really renovated. All right, so there we go. Avoid you there. Turn around. Turn around. There we go. All right, sweet, sweet. Uh, nope, nope. Oh, okay. All right. All right. I gotta be like careful because I want to get away with no trainers here. That would be great. There we go. Look away. Look away. There you go. All right, sweet. That's the first one. That's the first one. There we go. And this guy, we're not going to be able to avoid, it looks like, sadly. Alright, it's alright to get in a few trainer battles. I mean, remember, we still want to be adequately leveled for this gym. We want to be under-leveled, exactly. But we're looking really good right now. We got a... Awesome Mega Evolution. Mega Swampert, gonna be pimping. And yeah, <laughs> the Mega Evolutions these past, like, two episodes, we have been just racking them up. Just like it was nothing. All right, so we're gonna get this mega evo. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Boom! I'm gonna wreck your shit. Roar! That's what he's saying right there. Oh man, I don't even know. All right, so we're gonna get double hit. Blah blah blah. Whatever. Suck my dick. Suck my dick. That was a crit. <laughs> that was a crit. Everybody, come on. Just just take a moment to enjoy that. And then the surf. And then the surf. And then the surf. Uh, I'm sorry. I love Swampert. I really love Swampert. And then once they gave it a mega. That looks like it's on fucking steroids. I just kind of shit my pants. Anyway, moving on. We do have a Pelipper, and, you know, I would love to use Mega Swampert just a touch more. But I think this uh, Pelipper is just a great Pokemon to use uh, to face our uh, mana trick with, or whatever. I did not word that well at all. Alright, uh, we're going to use Volt Switch. And if this is one hit, I don't know what to say about life. There we go. Now, 
Manectric, not Electric, because Electric couldn't one-hit it. Now our Manectric, with a better move, uh, instead of Spark, can actually, you know, defeat a Pelipper, which is good. Alright, anyway, Camper Terrell was it? I don't even know. He was defeated. Like, the, that, was, that was weird, like, a second ago, my whole sentence was, like, spoken in, like, little fragments. Like, right now, this trainer is battling us. <laughs> Alright, uh, what does this guy have? Eh, only one Pokemon. It is a Dodrio. It is a Dodrio. We're going to... I think we're going to go for, yeah, Mega Swampert with Surf. Oh, man. I want you guys to let me know if you like the fact that I'm using just Mega Evolutions up to this point. I think I'm just going to have my six Pokemon be a Mega Evo. Just because I, I don't want to, like, break the uh, break the chain. That would be a little weird. But I want you guys to let me know because it's, uh, it's pretty chill. Not going to lie, it's pretty chill. It's, uh, it's nice. It's nice. <laughs> I don't know if you guys like it or not, but if I'm too OP, but I just love Mega Evolutions, and I want to get my hands on as many new ones, or ones that I haven't used before, uh, like, under my belt. And, Latias, uh, I have used a little bit. Magic, I pretty much haven't used at all. Obviously, Swampert and Metagross, I haven't used at all, unless you count the demo, but that was, like, for, what, an hour? You know, for two hours, whatever, how long it was. An hour and a half, I would say, actually. You know, it's, they're, they're pretty much all new to me. Like, I haven't used any of them in a full playthrough. Let's just put it that way. I haven't played any of them in, like, half a playthrough. You know. Alright. Uh, I hope we don't have too many more of these battles left. Uh, because I do want to make a little forward progress, you know. What am I doing? Hey, there we go. Boom. Mm. Alright. There we go. Nope. Well, no. The animation takes like a long, well, compared to what it used to be, like half a second. It takes like a second for the animation to go if you're pushing, but it doesn't push through. Alright, we can avoid this. We can avoid this pretty easy, I think. There we go. Sweet. And now we have Winona. We have Winona. Alright, as much as I would love, 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 love to use our Mega Swamper, I think it would just be the smartest idea to use Mega Manectric in this case. Uh, just for tight matchups and stuff. But like I said, I fucking love Mega uh, Swamper. It kind of hurts me a little bit inside not to use that uh, Mega... Not to use the Mega Swamper and choose the Mega Nerd to go over it, but oh well. Uh, I am Winona. I am the leader of Fortree Pokemon Gym. Yep, thanks for sharing. You're awesome. Whatever. I have become one with a bird Pokemon and have Sword the Skies. I think you're high, but that's cool. That's cool with me. No one judges. No judging. However, grueling the battle, we will triumph with grace. Wow. Them camera angles, though, and what is like camera? What the hell? Uh, witness the elegant choreography of my bird Pokemon and me. I could just like picture in this gym, just wait till design. I could just picture a Pokemon battle in this. I feel like that would be really cool. I got some bird Pokemon flying all over the place. You got Skarmory flying by, Tropius, all these different flying types. I don't know what she has in this game, but uh, she, had, she had a good variety in one of the games. I think the. I forget which one. One of them she had a Tropius and. I don't know. I forget. I don't even know anymore. Alright, uh, a swell level 33. Not terribly concerned exactly. Uh, we're gonna hit that Mega Evolution. Our team is still nice and OP, so I'm not really concerned with this gym. It's not a Nuzlocke or anything, so if Pokemon die is not the end of the world. If this is Nuzlocke, you know, I'll be much more careful. But, you know, that's not the case. So, double team, uh, that can be dangerous. I'm not gonna lie. Double team after, like, a few turns can be dangerous, but as long as you hit it on, the, like, the first turn, you're looking pretty okay. And there we go. We get the Swellow. We get the Swellow in one shot. That's phenomenal right there. And no matter what, this is the nice thing about Volt Switch. If it one hits, if it one hits, then you do get to, like, I think you get to choose which Pokemon you really want for uh, the next Pokemon. Like, you get to choose which Pokemon you want sent out when she sends out a new one. See, look, yeah. So we can just go, literally, just go right back out into our Manectric if we want to, which I do want to do. I think, is Electric not great against Dragon? I forget. Either way, we're going to go for Volt Switch, see how it does. And uh, if it doesn't hit, which it might not, we'll just go for uh, Latios or something. But, yeah. I believe this is their ace, so level 35 isn't terrible compared to our levels. Uh, we're still a little bit over-leveled with some of our Pokemon compared to that. But, uh, okay, yeah, that does not do a lot. I think I'm just gonna go for the, I would say, a pretty safe bet with our Latios with uh, Dragon Breath. I think that should do good enough, maybe, to two-hit it compared to what it has right now. Cotton Guard, does that, does that raise its defense? Oh, shit. Um... Yeah, that's not good, but I think that Dragon Breath is a special move. I don't know why it'll be physical, because it's like, yeah, it's not actually physically attacking it. But, hey, would you look at that? That is pretty nice. And what are you using? Are you using Roost? Come on, don't be a bitch. What a bitch. It's alright. We should be able to one-hit it from here, because uh, 
before it was a little bit higher, I think, and we got down to like 1 HP, so yeah, there we go, nice and easy. Altaria is out, and that's awesome. We're halfway done, and that was her ace, so that's pretty cool. Manectric grows to level 30, and Discharge, ooh, who the power is in the house, and no, 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 no. Yes, that, that contest button has messed me up so many times. Yeah, it's 80 damage, holy shit. And Vault Switch is a little annoying because of that uh, switch element. I'm not a huge fan of it, and uh, we can always reteach it to it if we want it, but, I mean, Discharge is so nice, not gonna lie. Uh, Skarmory? Um, I think I'm still gonna go for the Mega Manectric with Discharge. Well, in this case, Discharge. <laughs> Used to say in Vault Switch, but yeah. We're gonna go for the, uh, we're gonna go for the Discharge. And hopefully that should be enough, because now Discharge does even a little more damage, which is cool. We're another level higher, so our stats are even higher, and, I mean, Discharge also raises your stab as well, because, you know, it's, uh, whatever, it was 105, I think? It was 105 base with Volt Switch, with the, uh, stab added, and with this, it's 120, so that's a big difference, actually. It's, like, 15, 15 difference, and then when you add the two times difference from, uh, you know, type super effectiveness, yeah. I don't know, I'm just boring you guys right now, but, uh, Protect, really, you are just prolonging the inevitable. You are prolonging the inevitable so bad. Alright, Discharge, nice, and one hit. If this is one hit, I, I don't care. Close in the channel. Close in the channel. <laughs> that was such an easy one hit. It's not even funny. Alright. Gyarados, and I think Swana as well, with Pelipper, all those water flying types. You gotta feel bad a little bit for him. You gotta feel bad a little bit. Alright, so... That's Winona, I recognize your talent, present you with this gym match. She seems, like, so happy that we beat her. <laughs> we just, like, destroyed her. Like, really. She didn't even put any Pokemon on fucking, like, yellow. Damn. I didn't even have to use any items or anything. This is pretty easy. Uh, with the Feather Badge, all Pokemon up to level 70. Yep, little Beas, that's pretty cool. And now we can use Fly, and we get Roost, which is a pretty cool move. Roost uh, can be very useful uh, in battle. More, more so competitive, but, uh, you know, in a lot of play, it's still a nice move to have. Alright, so we're 27 minutes in, or just about, yeah, and if this was a normal episode, then yeah, we would end it right now, but shit, I want to fly on our Latios, or Latias, whatever, and uh, I hope it works just by using fly. I really do, I hope it works, just like, you know, just use fly, and it's as simple as that. Um, yeah, we do get to fly to routes now, which is awesome, but, I don't know, let's, let's fly to Mauville, can I, can I actually, like, fly on this thing? I don't know exactly how it works, like I said, I haven't used it before. Alright, so, yeah, it's not gonna, it's not going to actually, like, hmm. I'll have to find out how to actually, like, fly. I guess there's, like, some type of tutorial at one point or whatever, but let's fly to Route 120. Or no, we can't? What the fuck? I thought that we could, wow, I thought that we could fly to routes. Oh, no, we can. I don't know why it didn't let me fly to Route 120, but it let me fly to Route 119. Oh well, either way, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, and uh, hit that subscribe button if you are new. Uh, I'll find out, and, no, wow, I was about to buy that guy. Did not want to do that. Yeah, I'll find out if I'm the Latias. I, like, everyone else that's watching here knows, because everyone, like, finished the game but me, but, you know. Uh, yeah, I'll find out, and that'll be fun. So I'll see you guys in the next video, though. Till next time, peace.